So it is an inconvenience for everybody because you need your license. Searching for answers that weren't found through the windows of the OMV on Veterans Boulevard. Because you're being out hours, so you plan your day for the DMV and to come here and they close. Yeah, it's aggravating. About a statewide outage for multiple offices, including the OMV, that state officials say stem from a hardware malfunction during scheduled maintenance Wednesday night. A phrase which basically means... I mean, hard drives failed. It could mean like a network router that was doing a lot of the internet connectivity between the departments failed. It could mean uh, a database went down because of a hard drive failed. Ryan Jones is a cybersecurity expert and says there is no telling when those services could return. If it was something simple like a hard drive, they, they just put a new hard drive in and restore it from backups, which could take, you know, maybe a day, depending on how, how long it took to get the backups on site and put onto the machine and, and whatnot. But if it's something like, if it's something like a specialized router, like a network router or something like a, you know, some, some custom piece of hardware they had designed for some reason, that, that could take longer. This isn't the first time this has happened. State offices were closed multiple times during the COVID-19 pandemic, but also notably in 2019 during a cyber hack that caused Governor John Bell Edwards to declare a state of emergency. For locals today, it's as inconvenient as ever. My license is expired and I get stopped by the police. I can't tell him that. He won't give me a ticket. And we've asked the state multiple times for updates on when the services could be back online. We have still not heard back. Reporting live, Eli Brand, WDSU News. Back to you. All right, Eli, thank you. Other state agencies impacted include the Department of Wildlife and Fisheries, LDH, the Louisiana Department of Medicaid, and multiple other agencies.